Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the Windows Update Error 0x8007277 in Windows 10. So this could definitely be a frustrating issue and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully address that the uh, requested service provider cannot be loaded or initialized. So pretty straightforward process and we're going to go and jump right into it by opening up the start menu. Just left click on the start button one time, type in CMD, best match should come back with command prompt. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. Into this elevate command line window, you want to go type in NETSH space Winsock space reset. So again, NETSH WINSOCK space reset, exactly as it appears on my screen. Then you want to hit enter on your keyboard to run that. You will have to restart your computer, so hopefully that would have been able to resolve the problem. So if you're still experiencing an issue, if we close out of here, after you've restarted your computer, open up the start menu, type in troubleshoot. One of the best matches should come back with troubleshoot settings. Left click on that one time. On the right side underneath get up and running, select Windows Update, resolve problems that prevent you from updating Windows, and then left click on run the troubleshooter. So hopefully it was able to resolve issues here and click on close with just restarting your computer once it's done running and hopefully that's been able to resolve your problem. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.